everyone, I'm Jess, and this week we're getting hands-on with the Call of Duty mystery box to celebrate the release of Black Ops 4, winding it back to the start of Zombies, and talking you through all the latest news and upcoming releases. Here's the TLDR. Ever regretted your PlayStation username? Well, rejoice as Sony are trialling a name change system. The coming soon update will allow you to fix the mistakes of a colourful youth in favour of a more widely acceptable name. Users who decide to change their IDs will have the option to display their old username alongside their new one, so friends can still recognise who they are. However, if you do decide to display the old one, you won't be able to remove that option. According to Sony, the first change is free, but after that, each swap will cost, although the cost is reduced for PlayStation Plus members. A new generation is looming in Pokemon Go, with more news being revealed about the newly discovered disguised Pokemon and a hint of what's to come. Over the last few weeks, Pokemon Go players have been nabbing a new Pokemon and watching in dismay as it transforms into a ditto upon capture. Turns out the sneaky little creature is a mythical and a tease of what's to come. If you transfer a Pokemon from Go to Let's Go, you'll receive a mystery box, which is apparently the key to catching Melton. However, fear not if you don't own a Switch, as Niantic confirmed that mythical research will be coming later this year to aid those without the Nintendo console in catching the cute little creature. On top of this, Niantic have revealed that Gen 4 will be coming soon, so make sure to clear out your Pokemon storage to make way for Turtwig, Chimchar, Piplup and Co. We had the explosive announcement earlier this week that Borderlands 2, the game with a gutful of dynamite, is coming to VR. The hugely popular shoot and loot title of 2012 has sold over 13 million copies worldwide, and this December both new and veteran Vault Hunters will be able to experience Pandora in all its glory in a whole new way. At the moment, it looks like Borderlands 2 VR will be exclusive to the PSVR and will use a combination of controller-based and real-time aiming to bring the chaotic and colourful shooter to life. No word yet on if the VR port will come with the huge amount of DLC that followed on from the initial game's release, but a vanilla version is definitely enough to get us excited. And finally, in a heartwarming follow-on from our Telltale special last week, Skybound Games have confirmed they will be picking up the unfinished project of The Walking Dead final season. Robert Kirkman, creator of the Walking Dead comic book series, stated in a tweet earlier this week that his studio, Skybound Games, would pick up the project. Finishing the last two chapters in the series, it seems a fitting end to the episodic decision-based game and will allow players to see Clem's story through to the end. Rumour has it that the company plans to work with members of the Telltale team to finish the game, although nothing is finalised at this point. We can only hope that both this, the Telltale team and Clem get the happy ending we're hoping for. Courtesy of the lovely folk at Activision, we were lucky enough to get up close and personal with the Mystery Box Edition of Call of Duty Black Ops 4 in a celebration of all things zombie. The Mystery Box Edition of Black Ops 4 includes a copy of the latest edition in the Call of Duty franchise and, of course, a collectible steelbook to keep it in, alongside additional digital content including the Black Ops Pass. However, this version also has a heap of other creepy keepsakes to complete anyone's collection. A huge and eerie box depicting screaming ghouls and clasping claws, the mystery box not only lights up, but also houses all the other goodies that Activision are including in this limited edition. And we're very impressed with the goodies. A Dark Horse Zombies comic with exclusive cover, 10 physical specialist patches, a Black Ops branded pop socket and 4 zombie fig pins accompanying 3 zombie lithographs. For us though, the favourite offering was definitely the exclusive 1000 piece zombie jigsaw puzzle perfect for distracting your thoughts from all those flesh-eating foes. The mystery box is available now in limited amount, so make sure you click the link below if this has taken your fancy. A rich narrative-driven puzzle experience, Torn, arrives for PSVR on the 26th of October. Eccentric physicist Dr Lawrence Tabalt has been missing for 64 years and now you must explore his abandoned mansion. Travel to a new dimension using the gravity tool as you uncover secrets and solve puzzles to unravel the mystery. Brought to you from the writers of Tomb Raider, Bioshock and Stranglehold, and accompanied by an original score from Bioshock's composer, this dark science fiction mystery is inspired by Black Mirror and The Twilight Zone, and is sure to leave you uneasy and enthralled. Mystery horror pen and paper RPG Call of Cthulhu is venturing into the digital world when the game adaption lands on PS4 and Xbox One on the 30th of October. Step into the mind of H.P. Lovecraft in this semi-open world psychological horror. With investigative and stealth-based play, you will play as Edward Pierce, a private detective in an existential crisis. Investigating the tragic death of the Hawkins family, it soon becomes apparent that not everything is as it seems, as you are plunged into a world of conspiracy theories, cultists and cosmic horrors. Enjoy the cult classic arcade rhythm game from Japan in the comfort of your own home in Taiko no Tatsujin Drum and Fun 
Coming to Nintendo Switch on November 2nd, this rhythm-based title will have you tapping away as you work your way through a catchy track list. Play to the beat and challenge your friends as you use motion controllers like never before, unlocking characters along the way as you journey to being the best taiko drummer. The interactive features of the Nintendo Switch also allow you to connect, share and play with your family and friends to see who has the best taiko skills. After getting hands-on with the amazing Mystery Box Edition for Black Ops 4, we got to reminiscing about not only our favourite zombie maps, but also the original zombie maps. So this week we're winding back to the start of our obsession with shooting zombies, Call of Duty style. World at War was the first game in the franchise to feature a zombies map, and Nactar on Totem proved to be an instant hit. Located in an abandoned airfield, up to four players played as unnamed soldiers, defending themselves against an infinite number of waves of the undead for as long as possible. Due to Nactar on Totem being the first Zombies map, it was relatively simple in comparison to most of its successor maps. Weapons could be bought off the wall, and only two utilities were available to players to help them survive against the Horde. These have all been important contributions to later maps. The Mystery Box would allow players to spin the box for 950 points to receive a random weapon. The player could get anything from a wall weapon, and could choose whether to take them. If not taken, the box would reset, allowing for another reroll at cost of more credits. In contrast to this, players automatically took the weapon given to them by the sniper cabinet. Due to the massive popularity, more time and story was written into the world of zombies, sparking what's referred to today as a canon and alternative narrative arc. Treyarch also established fully-fledged characters compared to the unknown soldiers in Entoten to help flesh out the zombie backstory. In later years, certain maps brought in new characters, with voice acting by guest celebrities such as Jeff Goldblum, Sarah Michelle Gellar and David Tennant. Several remasters and easter eggs throwing back to Nacta and Toten have been included throughout the last decade as Zombie became a staple part of the COD franchise. Let us know your favourite finds in the comments. Thanks for joining us, we'll be back in the same place at the same time next week. Make sure you like, subscribe and ring that bell to always get the TLDR. At Game Right Now, pick up selected new releases for half price when you trade in towards them. For terms and conditions, check the link below and pop into your local game store now.